Martin's success can be attributed to a big repertoire and a dynamic, enthusiastic attitude towards wave riding. That's what surfing's all about, is to be able to not have one maneuver in your repertoire, is to be able to link all those maneuvers up on one wave. And if you do that, you're going to win. I'd say it's a good sport to be in, but it's the kind of sport that, if you're not really into it, it'll leave you behind like that. So if you want to be a pro surfer, you've got to be keen, mean, and also smart. No one in the top 30 is remotely similar. Martin Potter is as inspiring today as he was when he slammed open the door on his career at age 16 in Durban, South Africa. Although Potter has never won a world championship, when it comes to free surfing, he's been the best, or real close to the best, for the past seven years. Young surfers in particular can really relate to Martin's radical approach. He's a surfer who will never bow to convention. 